What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Is it too early for some fall vibes? So I don't know about you guys, but uh, your girl, she considers fall technically starting um, once the ember months start, you know, like September, October, November, December. So it's September, literally a couple days away. I figure why not? Head start, your girl, she was up on Gymshark's website again. She saw some dope fall type style stuff, different colors, all that girl, you know? I just like felt the vibes and I said, wait a minute, I think I could use this. Yeah, I can. So I stocked up on some of the training collection. In case you guys don't know, Gymshark's training collection is like comfort, yoga based. They got sports bras in everything from low support to very high support. It is dope and it's honestly one of their more affordable collections. So it's one of my favorite, like hands down. Like I'm wearing their sports bra right now. Rush baby, Rush training. So, uh, I'm coming at you with a fun fall kind of haul, okay? I actually picked pieces to specifically pair with normal outdoors type of clothing. You know, things you can vibe with in the fall time. Just to spice it up a little bit. Fall fashion is honestly my favorite out of every kind of fashion. And if I can mix intermingle Gymshark for crying out loud, it's a recipe for success. So I got like this mini, little mini lookbook coming your way, kind of showing you how I'm pairing their training collection. That's right, the training, their long sleeves, all that good stuff, even the leggings where you can wear out and about, if you're going to school, out to the market, whatever girl, I got you. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be real fun. But before we get into it, if you're not already, definitely hit that subscribe button, baby girl. I promise you, you won't regret it. And follow your girl on IG for all things fitness. Because together, we got this. Now let's go. Let me go stain up my teeth and uh, chit chat. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome. Your girl, she tries to have everything linked down below, my measurements, all that good stuff, just for your reference so you can kind of size it up and see what might work for you. Also, speaking of links, ah, if you guys follow me on Instagram or if you've seen in the community board here on YouTube, your girl, she got an affiliate link from Gymshark. It's crazy. Like it's a legit link. So uh, yeah, I'll have that down below. Thank you if you choose to shop through it. All right, so let's get into this haul. Guys, I do have full in-depth reviews on like the training collection, the bras. I'll have that linked below as well. If you wanna see a really intense, full, in-depth, detailed review on that. This for the most part is just gonna be how I'm styling and the whole just overview. I have training leggings in that sage color and I love them. I get the seven eighths because I am five foot three. So I'm a little bit short and the seven eighths that they have available in the training collection is bomb. I got the gray, the light gray that they have. I also got this gorgeous like brownish purple color. It's in the color rose taupe. Everything is in a size small. Again, my true to size size. And this one's in the color, I don't even know how to pronounce, obsidian green, okay? <laughs> so it's a really like dark hunter green. Doesn't quite match my dark hunter green sports bra from the training collection if you're wondering. It does not, it's not a, not a complete match, dang. So anywho, I had to get these colors because these are just like the perfect full colors to pair things with. The 78 legging has a 25 inch inseam, so this fits me perfectly. I tried their very light, like summery orange color and it wasn't fully squat proof, but these have all been squat proof. Believe it or not, even the gray has been squat proof for me. So I'm very excited about that, but that's just me. And that's just how it fits me. Everyone's different. What I love, other than the affordability, about these freaking leggings is that they're so buttery soft and stretchy. They're perfect for the active gal, whether you're doing yoga, going for walks, whatever, or like I said, school somewhere where you're sitting a lot and you wanna be super comfortable. These are just where it's at. The color variety is on point. And a lot of people, I've heard a lot of people say that these seem to slide down on them, but for me, I feel like as long as you pull them up enough, 
and really pull them up like stockings, like from the base up, and you really tug them up, you should be fine. When I squat, they don't like roll down on me or anything like that. This is not seamless, but for crying out loud, if there was a yoga seamed legging that was so stinking close to looking seamless, it's these. I have the same feeling. Like I honestly, other than the seam on the band, I really just, they're like oh, barely like there. Like these are pretty much seamless for me. They just smooth everything out, but they're not very compressive. So if you are somebody who wants to kind of conceal cellulite or wants something high impact, then I would steer away from these leggings. But other than that, man, if you want that ultra comfort, ooh, it's like you're wearing nothing but air. Who doesn't want to wear air? I do. Like I said before, guys, the new colors in the training collection are so full oriented. So let me tell you something. These neutrals, they're very like tapered down colors where they're almost kind of faded. I respect that. I love that. I need that in my life, girlfriend. So the light gray, you already know I'm a be pairing these, I already know, with some nice denim blues. Gray and blue, they're both cool tones and they really complement each other. So I have a gray Gymshark beanie that'll look pretty nice with this. A nice denim jacket and then black boots to kind of break up the blue and the gray and you're still in the cool tone family. So I really love that look. Yeah, I'm gonna be mixing this up with that jean action. Mmm, gray and jeans, absolutely. Okay, so when I saw these freaking obsidian gorgeous leggings, this green is such a unique dark rich green that it looked like a real dense hydrated forest. So therefore, I have to pair it with browns and tans so that it completes that forest look. I want to look like I'm out up in that very hydrated forest. So. I got this like really nice snuggly cardigan that's this really nice light tan, super cozy vibes that I'm gonna wear with this. And some dark, rich brown boots with this. Are you joking me right now? You're asking for it, girl. You're asking for the compliments, basically. And this rose taupe is such a beautiful, like it's a mixture between lavender and gray. So it's got some warm and cool tones in it, so it's a little bit more difficult to try to pair other than just pairing it with like a white shirt or something. So when I saw their new training cropped sweaters, <laughs> I had to get that freaking light pink because I knew that it would really make this set one and whole. Yes. Oh yeah, you got lots of like nice complimentary colors right here. So it's a really nice breakup, cool contrast going on. <sighs> this light pink, when I saw it, it's more of like just like that blushy pink. So early fall time, you feel me, girl? I really had to get this because I noticed Gymshark switched up their training sweaters, their crop sweater look. Instead of just the white minimalist like logo saying Gymshark, they got the little baby shark face on the upper left hand side. So I had to get it because I live for their training sweaters. Like, are you kidding me? They're the easiest thing to put on. It's a little baby high to low. So it's ever so slightly more cropped in the front, lower in the back. It's a really nice flattering look, super comfortable. You got that really nice ribbed detail going underneath the arm and down the side. So I'm just a huge fan altogether. It's the simple piece that you could just throw over your sets if you're going to the gym or even if you're just trying to show out, go pumpkin picking or something like that, girl, you feel me? What I love about this is it's not enough of a summer pink. Like I wouldn't classify this as summer at all. It's got that those clay tones to it. They're a little more muted tones. So it really does make for a nice like dusky, dusty fall. Does that make sense? <laughs> so yeah, definitely gonna be wearing this once my gym opens, if I decide to go back. I'm definitely gonna be utilizing this sweater to throw over these really gorgeous leggings that you saw today. <laughs> uh, it would look really nice and part of the same collection. So absolutely, two thumbs up. Love this color. All right guys, so moving on to a couple training bras that I got. Again, Gymshark's training collection bras are amazing because depending on what you need, you can find that support level. So I appreciate that. It's one of the few collections they have where there's variety to the level of support. So I tend to go 
for their low support because I mean, I'm doing and crazy. I'm gonna be real with you. Like, I don't like bounce up and down that much. I don't do cardio very much. <laughs> uh, so I tend to go to the low support like this, the Rushed. Uh, but I did get a little variety in this one. We got a medium sports bra. This is the mesh back. I saw this like olive green and I thought it would look really great with the taupes, with uh, the other like earth tone colors, the browns, you know, the new energy and seamless that just launched that I picked up, you know, mix and matching up in here, girl. Stay posted for that hole. That one's coming up very soon. But even the brown freaking vital, brown and green. Again, out up in nature. So this baby's pretty nice. It's not as low cut as I thought, which could be a good thing for me. I need it to be a little more low cut. I need to make it look like I got something going on here that ain't going on here. This is good because like I said, medium support, you got the bra pads in it, the mesh back, racer back type of look, keyhole, you have the adjustable straps, like the bra wiring. So there is, you can feel that support. The band is super sturdy. Like this ain't going nowhere. Uh, but like I said, it's right in the middle where it's definitely not high neck, it's not low cut, it's just enough. I think it's overall very beautiful. The color is what spoke to me, not gonna lie. Um, but it's a really great supportive sports bra. I don't need this much support, but I definitely respect it and I appreciate it. In case I do, you never know. Maybe one day I decide to go running. Probably not. <laughs> I got the scoop neck. So when did these like come out? <laughs> because I'm just browsing, seeing all these new training bras and like no one uttered a word. So the scoop neck is pretty dope, not gonna lie. I got it in black because you can't have too many black. It's a very versatile piece. This baby is in low support. Perfect. This is why, because the low support, man, makes the gals look really good. Don't know why, that's how it is. So these really are flattering that department, okay? Uh, nice adjustable backing, very simple and straightforward. The shark face, stark white, right in the middle, sharp at you, you're at the gym. Someone's gonna look at you and look straight at that freaking logo. They ain't even gonna notice you, they're gonna see that shark face. This is a nice contrast. I need that Pam in your face. <laughs> These do have removable padding as well, like the rest of them, love it. And last but not least, I got, because of the color again, the taupe open back mesh, which I already have this bra in a different color. This one's super high support. The high impact here does not have removable padding. It's stitched in, so it's not going anywhere because they're assuming that you're like launching your body up into space. They don't want your pads to go flying out. Mm, you know, I get it. I really love that mesh like lining around the front, the racer back open racer back adjustable straps, not one, but two. And of course that like bra clip right here. So this is maximum support if you need it. If you have bigger busts, if you're blessed, go for the higher impact, trust in your girl. I mean, thank God for these adjustable straps in the back or else this would be hanging off of me because I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Just really glad I got this because a nice neutral taupe can go with any tank. All right guys, so here comes the fun part. Just like we styled the leggings for fall time at outdoor clothes, we're doing the same with the longer sleeve tops, those kinds of, you know, the athleisure -y type of tops in the training collection. Here we go. I didn't even bother with the sports bras because they're freaking sports bras. I ain't about to just probably wear them out and about during the fall time. They're gonna be under what you see now. <laughs> Most of the jeans that you see me pairing things with are from Fit Jeans, so I did a full review on them as well. I'll have that link down below, but absolutely love them. They have a great variety, nice stretch to them, so they're not like denim denim, where you're like restricted and can't move your body. Other than that, we do have one gray pair that I got from Primark, which is a little more low cut. But for the most part, everything's Fit Jeans, and they are high rise, because I do prefer that, that high waist. We got the long sleeve top in tote. I just wanna say there's lots of shades of taupe. Like this is taupe, this is taupe, everything's taupe. This is a little more of that darker, more browny, a little purpley, but it's darker toned. Cool. Love the long sleeve top, it is oversized. I like it because the sleeves are nice and fitted for the most part, but right in the actual body part, it's flowy. So it's not stuck up against you. I don't always like to feel like I'm wearing skin tight things when I'm out and about, man. If I'm going to Target to look at home decor for fall, 
or if I'm going pumpkin picking with my family, I'm not trying to feel like I'm wearing like a corset. Like I wanna actually be flowy out and about, feel free. So this baby, oof, I had fun pairing this with real basic medium wash denim. So medium wash is where it's at. The blue contrast looks really nice with this like brownish purpley tone. I actually paired this with gray boots. Very faded gray, again, medium color, because it goes really well with the tone of the shirt. Always make sure when you are matching your shoes with your top that they kind of blend well together and everything in between, accessories, jeans, they could kind of be more of the pop that you want. But I always feel like the shoes kind of gotta, you gotta have something matching with the shoes or else you're gonna look freaking awkward. That's just my rule with them. Uh, but yeah, absolutely love this fit and I definitely have tried to tuck the shirts in different ways. I find that this particular fit because it could be a freaking nightgown on me for crying out loud. It looks best tucked in from the sides and having it kind of draped and flowing in the middle rather than tucked in the front. This is just me and I think this is how it really looks the most flattering. So a little bit of inspo for you. All right guys, so I got the training oversized tee in white. Totes gonna regret getting this white. Like, I don't even know why I got it, but you know what? I like the look of a crisp white t-shirt so much that it's worth me ruining it and then just buying a new one. <laughs> so this baby is really comfortable. Straight off the bat, like I love it. It is see-through though. So you have to wear like a nice sports bra underneath. I just wore like a basic black sports bra or a nude or white, but yeah, keep that in mind. You do have a nice side tie here, which is why I got it, because I thought it would look really sweet with a pair of jeans. I paired this with light wash, very distressed jeans. You could even technically make this a summer look, but to make this seem a little more full, you could totally like wrap a nice vibrant scarf around you. I have a really nice rustic-y orange, perfect for fall type of pom-pom beanie that I am just dying to wear with this, just to break it up and get that fall look going. And a pair of super badass <laughs> combat boots that I got from a thrift store. So I thought this would look really cool because it's got that edgy look. You got the side tie, you got distressed jeans, and then you got to pair it with some boom, combat boots. So you automatically got that fall look, but this is something I would wear early fall. You know, transitioning from summer into fall, you could do with or without the beanie, but yeah, those hotter fall days where it's not, not quite like that cool breeze yet, totally. Yes, this is super comfortable and lightweight. I love it. All right, guys, lastly, woo, got the training oversized tank. Had to do it. So as you can see, they do a lot of that oversized baggy look. Love that because it's ultra comfort, girl. So uh, yes to this freaking green. This is their sage green. So not quite olive, dark, hunter, nothing like that. It is a sage green, which they actually promoted a lot during the summertime. If you remember, I pretty much bought out every single thing they had in sage green. So good, this color is everything. So it's like light enough to still be summery, but like you could totally make this a fall look. I love it because you have the drop sleeve and you've got a lot of room to breathe here. You do have to wear a sports bra underneath it or else you might see a little side something up in here but it's okay, just wear a nice black bra, green, what else? You got the whole mesh up on the back here. I'm obsessed with this tank. I'm gonna be wearing it every day right now because it's still hot out, unfortunately. These tops as a whole in this collection, they are soft, they have that very cottony feel. You can definitely feel like the stretch. You can feel that these will wick. That's what I love, especially, because I can't wear like just straight cotton because I sweat so much. So like, it don't work for me. I need to have an active tank all year round. I'm that kind of girl right now. Like right now I'm sweating, in fact. So having this kind of material, this is why I love Gymshark because thank you for hooking me up with the dopest active wear, but now you're hooking me up with the dopest athleisure and just everyday use. Amen, a freaking men. So anyways, love it. It is long, it is perfect to get tucked up in those jeans for the fall. I paired this with a nice lighter gray pair of jeans. Yes, I said it, gray. And it complements the green so well because they're both that faded out tone. I love it. These gray jeans are from Primark. These are the ones I was talking about. Primark! I also have a super lightweight scarf that's really close up on the neck. 
that looked great with this. It's a light tan, very like, just a very wanderer kind of style. It looks super like I'm about to go traveling this kind of look. I paired it with a nice, just simple white, flat kind of style shoe. This is the kind of outfit you just go grab a coffee in and like meet friends. You know what I mean? Like casual, comfy, everyday use. So overall, I'm just so pleased with this entire haul. Like straight up, I wasn't considering getting anything in the training collection other than just leggings and sports bras, just gym oriented, things like that that I could wear home. But after like seeing that they didn't like launch anything for the longest time, so I got to just staring at all their stuff, I'm not gonna lie. I just got to actually like really sifting through and looking at their newer releases. I said, wait a minute. I'm gonna just buy some normal stuff, man, and pair it for fall because I love fall. Your girl, she needs to hook herself up sometimes. Fall's her favorite season, okay? It's a celebration. So give this video a thumbs up if you agree with that. So thank you all so much for watching. If you have any questions about anything you saw today or like anything you need details on, definitely comment down below. Pop me a message over on Instagram. Let's chit chat it up, man. Like, what the heck? I hope you guys got some inspo in this video and I hope you found it helpful. Appreciate each and every single one of you for watching. Thank you. Do not forget to subscribe if you are not already. Follow your girl on IG for all things fitness and I'll see you in my next video.